Good morning, everyone. My name is Rabbi Uri Lesser, Director of Pastoral Care here at Grove and Jewish. Hope everyone is having a wonderful week. And we will continue our Onik Shabbat virtual series, 10.30 every Friday morning. Hope everyone is doing great. Shalom Aleichem, Malachay Ashar, Yes, Malachay Elyon, Mi Melech, Malachay Amlochim, Akadosh Baruch Hu. Shalom Aleichem, Malachay Ashar, This week's Torah portion we read Parshas Bahalotcha. Bahalotcha begins with the lighting of the menorah, the candles in the Beit HaMikdash. 
And the Torah explains that this commandment, this mitzvah, was specifically given to Aaron, to Aaron HaKohen to do as sort of a payoff for the fact that Aaron HaKohen was unable to bring a carbon, a sacrifice with the other leaders of the tribe. For the end of last week's Torah portion, the Torah in, deep, in great length goes through all the sacrifices that all the tribes gave. Now these, these were sacrifices given by the t- tribes other than the Kohanim, the priests. So the Medrash tells us that Aaron was a little bit upset. He said, how come I don't have the opportunity to bring a sacrifice like the other people do? So Aaron was given a different mitzvah to light the menorah. But the question is, is that this seems very, very trivial. It's a contest, who gets to do more? He's upset, like a child. Well, I didn't get to do this commandment. I want to do a different commandment. And also Aaron Akohen, Aaron was the high priest. He did the holiest, the most special service in the temple that no one else ever did. And Yom Kippur, he went to the Holy of Holies. So certainly he had a tremendous amount of opportunities, much more than anyone else, to serve in the temple. So he'd be upset because he just missed one opportunity. And the commentaries explain a beautiful idea that, yes, when you look at the big picture, certainly Aaron Akohen, Aaron, was the leader of the Jewish people. He had many more opportunities to serve God than anyone else in the entire world. Even Moshe, Moses, did not have the opportunities that Aaron had. But even when we have so many opportunities in life, if we miss one opportunity, it's something we should think about. And that's what Aaron did. He said, you know, I missed one chance. And even though I have so many other opportunities, but still, I want to be part of something bigger. Because the mitzvah, the the sacrifice I missed was a sacrifice that everyone was involved except for me. And sometimes we have to have the perspective that we want to be involved with things that everyone's involved with. Everyone's doing something good. Everyone's involved in something good. Even though we have many of our own things that we do on our own privately, but there's something about being part of a community, being part of a collective group doing the right thing. And that's something here at Gerwin we can always think about. What are things we could do together? What are ways we could grow together? What are things that we could together make a difference in not just our own personal life, but the lives of other people and the people around us? Lecha dehodi lekras kala pnei shabbos nekabela lecha dehodi lekras kala pnei shabbos nekabela shamor vezachor bedi borechor eshmi yahanu kelam yuchor. Hashem Echad Ushma Yechad Shem Osef Erez Velesila Lechad Odi Lekras Kala Pnei Shabbos Nekabela Lekras Shabbos Chuben Elchag Yimekor Haberacha Meirosh mikadem nesucha Sof maase b'machshav adfila lecha Dodi lekras kala Pnei shabos nekabela Mektash melech Ir melucha kumitzi imital ha'afechor Avlog sheves me <laughs> Korva el nafshi ge yahala lecha dodi lekras kala Pnei shabos nekabela his horere his horere Kiva horekumi yori uri uri shir dabering of our Hashem Layeh nigla lechad odi lekras kala pnei shabbos nekam bila 
Lo se lo she lo se call me. Majesh lo chachi u majami bahag yatsu. Ani ye yami v'nev neso irati la lechadodi. Cross kalop ne shaboz ne kabila yamin usma te froti. Bias hashem nahariti al yaveni shai beis alach me. Korbo el nashigi yala lechadodi lekras kala. Nei shabos ne kabela vayolim shisa shosayef verocha kukom ne vahala yech yoses ola yech elokayef kem sois gos ona kala lechad odi lekras kala. Nei shabos ne kabila bawi bishalom ateres bala gamberi na uvezala tochemu ne yam segula bawi kala bawi kala lechadodi lekras kala. Nei Shabbos Nekabila. At the end of this week's Torah portion, we have the story about Moshe, Moses, and his sister Miriam. Miriam did something where, although she did not have any bad intentions, but she spoke slightly despairingly about her brother Moshe, Moses, who was, we know, the great leader of the Jewish people. And although Miriam didn't mean any harm by it, she just pointed out certain positive features in her brother. We see Miriam was punished with leprosy, and the Jewish people had to wait, they had to wait in their camp until her leprosy went down. And one of the questions they asked is that really, Miriam, why was she punished so severely? She didn't do anything wrong. She meant she made some comments about her brother, and the comments were really made to show and to highlight some of his positive traits. However, since the comments could have been misconstrued in negative fashion, she was punished. And the lesson we learn from here is we have to be extremely careful about the words that we say. We may talk about someone in a nice way, but even if we talk about someone in a positive way, if the people around who may take our words not so seriously, who may think we're exaggerating, who may think we're being a little bit sarcastic, and they may twist our words even, that's something to be extra careful about. So as always, the lesson we learn is it's really better not to talk about other people. Talk about nice, there's plenty of things in the world to talk about. Talk about good things that go on in your life and lives of others. But to talk specifically about any person, any individual, in any situation, even if you mean so only in the most positive way, to be extremely careful that someone could turn around negatively. And the best way to avoid this is, that, is always just to be careful with the words that we speak. Dono la masher malach betarem ko yetzir nevra lies nasa bechev so kol azai mehelech shemone kravi achare ke klos ha kol leva hado yem loch nora vilu haya vilu hove vilu yihi Ruchi, 
Ajo Shehem Velo Ira. Having a happy and healthy Shabbat, a great weekend. We'll see everybody next week.